So Nicholas Gates reporting young Republican here in Tennessee's 8th Congressional District running Republican candidate would like to encourage everyone to vote in election 2014, whether it's me or for Congressman Fincher. Right now I'm on conference call with the White House, and of course, Princess Beatrix, this is your elected American boyfriend, promoted on Facebook that everyone loves us, the celebrity couple here in Memphis. A corporate appreciation to the global community. So Nicholas Gates reporting, and of course, here is the unopened letter. The President of the United States has just not been open for two months, and we're fast approaching three months regarding cultural origin. So Nicholas Gates reporting, it is pending the Victoria Village College Chapel Historic District. Wonder how many votes a Nicholas Cadiz get. I don't know. With the White House and a lot of media organizations on my side, I probably get pretty large percentage amount of votes. But anyway, I want to encourage everyone to vote, whether it's for me or for Congressman Fincher. I'm not even seeing if I'm voting for myself. I just want everyone to participate. Nicholas Cadiz is going to see it and I kind of miss it. Isn't this a form of a patent a letter from the President of the United States? This is Beatrix, this is your elected American boyfriend speaking. And of course, we're trying to make the Obamas like the Kennedy family here in the great state of Tennessee. So many people from around the world love me and Princess Beatrix being the celebrity couple here in Memphis, Tennessee. And of course, I kind of made a White House blog regarding it. And also a corporate appreciation to Tennessee Governor Bill Hass and then of course Shelby County Commissioner Heidi Schaefer. They are my two most favorite politicians here in Memphis, Tennessee that are over for the Republican Party. Of course, they're my two most favorite politicians. And also a corporate appreciation to Carol Chumley. Now, most people don't hear about Carol Chumley, you know, on the national level, you know, only on certain standards, but she is an awesome, awesome Democrat. She always supports me on Facebook. Very special person. And they're supposed to be supporting. Being an icon of this. I support both Democrats and Republicans. I support those two people who are good for me. And good to me. They're supposed to be supporting. Nicholas Cadiz being, you know, where is the, like, the, the, is it there like a, you know, a painting of me and Princess Beatrix somewhere in the White House? Nicholas Cadiz reporting, seeing and I kind of miss it. He snuck in the message, you even tell the President of the United States, how unique is that? God save the Queen. President Obama is always about diversity. He's an awesome, awesome person that comes to that office. This is Beatrix. This is your elected American boyfriend speaking. And also regarding the global economy, I think it would be great if we put in, you know, the United Kingdom and of course other European nations. Europe's an important ally to the United States. 
Mexican American. And of course, I just so love Buckingham Palace. We just include them in a lot of things we do regarding the uplift as well. But I find it's just very supportive. But that's what I like because I like my cultural heritage being a descendant of Victorian Village, Thomas Shepherd's State District. So I like anything having to do with the Queen, you know, the Pope, Princess Beatrix, of course, and even Princess Beatrix, the like American boyfriend. I like it. So I think it's very supportive. Question. Let me try to be questioning.